Hi everyone, it's Jojo from Mojo Jojo Plans, and today I wanted to show you my very first purchase from Lights Planner Action. I will link it down in the description below. There are so many fun things on that website. I had a hard time picking like what I was going to get. Originally I went to it because I wanted to get some stuff for Go Wild and then there wasn't really anything that I wanted or needed um, but she had a memory keeping like memory planning kind of section and so I kind of dove into that. Lots of fun things. I think I got a printable that's like a birthday um, like fun printables like things that you can fill in. It has spots for pictures. Uh, so I got a printable. Uh, I haven't printed it out yet. I need to get on that but the physical mail finally came in uh, and I'm really excited about it and I wanted to show you what I got so I kind of opened it and then I was like oh I want to show you like everybody else this because I'm so curious so first things first I did not know this was going to be this small like I wasn't paying attention to the dimensions on the website at all I was just like oh like I get to pick my color I get like the cover I get to pick the color of um the binding on it. I was like, that's so cool. And then I was like, oh, it's this kind of book. Like I, for some reason I was picturing in my head, like a normal size planner. And then I get this little thing and I was like, oh my gosh, but I think you guys are going to love this because I'm really excited about it. Um, so yeah, so, and I'll tell you what it is in a second. I hope, I don't know if there's a packing slip in here. Hold on. Um, I'm hoping the packing slip reminds me what it's called. It's a journal and it has prompts in it. Um, it's a five year journal. Okay, so that's what it is. It comes with this cute little card. You can color it. Um, and then this has like all of her sizes. She does have some disc bound stuff. Um, I don't think this had an option for that. So I was just kind of okay with that. So this is a five year journal and it was in the memory keeping section. And why I was so excited for this was, A, you get to customize the cover, like you got to pick it. So like you get to pick everything for this and then she makes it. So it did take a few weeks. Um, I ordered it at the end of January and it just got here mid February, like mid to end February. So it did take a little while, but that's cause like I literally got to pick everything like the cover and she had so many covers to choose from. I went with leopard of course. Um, and then you got to pick the coil cover. Um, cause I think she prints everything and like binds everything, you know, like in house kind of thing. So, um, it did take a little bit to get here, but I think it was worth it. Um, this was 50, dollars and then of course plus shipping but it is a five year journal so it comes with a really sturdy cover I would say pretty similar to like a happy planner thickness wise happy planner cover comes with this really nice coil again I chose both these options I love like just like neutral um and that was really there wasn't any I don't remember if there was color options but as soon as I saw leopard I was like sold like I don't even need to look anymore so this is a five year journal well what is a five year journal look how thick this is this has little prompts in it and each prompt in here is different and you fill it in every single year so it has every day of the entire year which I just think this is the coolest thing like what a fun way to memory keep right like if you don't want to do journaling if you don't want to do pictures I feel like this is a really fun way to memory keep in a simple way by just following these prompts um so January through December 31st so I'm going to zoom in just a little bit so you can see a little bit better there's no like major like there's no intro page it just has this uh what is this called graph paper on the inside the inside is blank but that's okay um but literally you just go in and it has 20 and then you put the year so i'd put 20 23 and then you write so it says what is your focus for the new year and i could write anything like maybe i just write my, my word learning how to let go of things blah, blah blah and then the next day it says what is your favorite caffeinated beverage you know, for mine, that would probably be like, well, I can't have anything, but if I were to choose something, like, it would be this, you know, um, and then list any new habits you're working on, what makes you feel alive, if tomorrow was a perfect day, what would it look like, where is your favorite place to buy stationery, and then so, basically, you keep this journal for five years, so you fill one spot in in here once a year. I just think that's so cool. Like, part of me wishes I found this, like, before the new year. 
so I could start and because I'm like conflicted I'm like do I start it this year do I have to wait another year and technically you could start you just want to have you know I mean I could also go through like I feel like it'd be okay to go through maybe not especially since we're only like ending you know our second month of the year but I might even just go through and then just kind of go based on what they are now as of like 2023 and then just kind of fill in but praise yourself for showing up each day and then like how did you do that you know uh share a truth bomb with your future self um I have a shopping addiction like noted uh will you do um, what will you do for fun tomorrow? What matters today? Write down the trending topic of today. What was in your mailbox today? Um, how much sleep did you get last night? So it just literally has a ton of different prompts and it's like that for an entire year. And then the new year starts and then you go back and you start all over again and I would put 2024. And maybe I remember in one of the examples it said there was one that was like what is your favorite snack or something like that and maybe your favorite snack changes right like sometimes it changes you might be craving something different um but i just thought this was a really cool book uh who was the last person you helped where's your favorite place to walk let's go somewhere in february did you use your time wisely today what is one act of kindness you could perform this week? What is the last movie you watched? So you could, then you can look back like over a span of five years and be like, oh, I watched this movie on this day. Or if it, it's saying what was the last movie you watched. So if like, obviously you didn't watch something on the 28th, then, you know, you can kind of just, you know, think of like, oh, like maybe a couple days ago, like I watched this on Friday or whatever that would be. Um, where is your favorite place to eat out? Like that's something that can change your cheer. Um, share some good advice. What was the last request you said no to? What is your favorite comfort food? Who would you like to get to know better? List three things you are loving right now. So I just thought this was really, really cool um, because I love anything memory wise and I have a hard time remembering a lot of things memory wise. So I just wanted to share this with you guys because I was really excited. This was my first purchase from Lights Planner Action. Again, it's handmade. So that is why it's a little bit more pricey. And again, you get to customize everything. Um, and they have and she has lots of different options of different things like I could probably sit for hours just like looking at all the stuff. She has printables. Um, and I think she had, I don't know if she had printables for something like this where you could, you know, just do this. But this is something you could even do in your, like on some notes pages, you know, like maybe Google search, you know, daily prompts or something, you know, uh, something simple like that. But I just wanted to share this with you guys real quick because I was really excited about it. And I'm excited to start it. I honestly think I'm just going to go back in and try to remember the best I can and if anything I'll put I might put like a little note like I filled this in a little late um but that way I can just like keep on it because I think this is really cool anyway I just wanted to share that with you from lights planner action I'll leave it linked down in the description below as well as the website that way you could just see all the things because there's lots of fun stuff on her website again if you'd rather do printables there are tons of options for printables on her website as well but there you go I just wanted to share that with you guys real quick but I still hope you enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to give a thumbs up and subscribe and I hope I'll see you in my next one bye